My name is Hannington Gochi. I work with the Rural Electrification Authority as a technician in the Renewable Energy Department. Uh, we chose Garissa because initially Garissa had been running on diesel generators, which were expensive. So the government decided to do a line from Kindaruma to supply Garissa, to connect Garissa to the national grid. The solar irradiance in Garissa is quite high. So to supply or support the grid, that is the voltage to support the line that came from Kindaruma, we decided to do a solar plant here to make use of the solar irradiance that is rich in Garissa. Now we can have investments of industries within here. There has been employment due to the low cost of electricity now and the businesses have come up, several of them and there has been employment that has been created as a result of the project, directly and indirectly. The, the panels will require cleaning uh, at least twice a year, and this uh, being around 85 hectares of land where the project lies, we shall need a lot of people to do the cleaning. There will also be people who will be required to clear the undergrowth so that it does not affect the, the, the output of the panels. Going out, due to the reduced cost of electricity, we have more people who are going to be connected to the grid. And this is going to impact positively as people now will be able to open various businesses and start running uh, shops, welding stations, and other businesses that will require power. And the employment created here is going to have an impact on the population within Garissa. And this being a gateway to the northeastern part, we have now people coming to Garissa because of the facilities that uh, will come with investments of this project.